So today I'm with Dalmont and we are checking out the next lineup in the review. So we are going to be looking at his main entry in just a second. But he has completed this ship while he was waiting for me to review everyone in front of him. This has been a new thing, speed builds while you're waiting. Uh, Indeed. And I think I fully support this. So what is the name of this ship that you've just built? What is uh, this one does not have a name yet. <laughs> Half an hour I think it took. Maybe we'll call it half an hour. 30 minute challenge. We'll call it the Type 30. The Type 30. <laughs> I like it. So, um, anything in particular you'd like to say about it, other than the fact that it only took half an hour? <laughs> um, it only took half an hour. There you go. <laughs> um, was trying to go for something that was uh, fairly sleek. I uh, wanted to do, like, some negative space, so I got those two engine pods with cool crystal bits, and could have done more. Ran out of time because this is like the first day I ever got a decent position in line. So <laughs> <laughs> there we go. So that's it. There it is. And I guess well, we looked at that. So let's jump down to the beef of the meal. So what is the name of this ship here? The beauty. All right. This is the SFW Crosswind, and she is a small patrol ship. find small uh i think this one's like 118 meters long it's all in all not that bad and this one was actually designed with uh one of those like i don't know what you'd call them they were cruisers from the battleship yamato i just finished rewatching the uh series with the new fancy animation and i really like that ship i think it was like Kodai's brother. But, uh, yeah, so this one's actually got a fully fleshed out interior, too. You go check it out. Right, and you got your gravity. Yep. Definitely gonna want no, gravity in this guy. No gravity. This one right here? Nope, no gravity. Faction permissions, that's why. Uh, of course. Hold on. Where is my car? You're in Imperium. Just work a function permission block under there, 346. Here, hit it. <laughs> okay, done. There you go. Alright, fantastic. Well, uh, this is the bridge. Yep. And it's as compact as it can possibly get. Nice. While still chair. cramming a bunch of detail in it. Definitely a cool view worth checking out. A couple of chairs. Really cool chairs. Look at that chair. Look at that chair. It's a double-sided chair. Come on. Double-sided chairs. Double-sided chairs. Wow. So we got joysticks for the pilot. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Got to have some visceral control. Okay. Where else can we go? Hop down. Oh, beautiful. Ha, ah, beautiful. Right, what else have we got? Oh, look at this. More computer screens. Oh, more computer screens, more chairs. Wow, I nearly reached this. I really need. I nearly reached new heights of parkour there. Oh, must be a huh? Yes! So we got screens and chairs and the core. And this core has an awesome view. When you get in it. And also. I tried to kind of do a thing with the core, kind of like a warp tube, or warp core rather. Oh. Might as well be a tube, it's, it doesn't even look like a core, it's a tube. The warp cylinder. So the warp cylinder. Yeah, I see that. Very nice. Is this as far as it goes back here? Yeah, yeah. Yep, that's as far as it goes. But a bit more space is inside than you'd think. Outside, it's a pretty small ship. It does. It does look very small. I don't know how the hell it... It looks like we're in a different ship at the moment, to be honest. Yep, and it also boasts 20,000 DPS plus turret, which are 2,500 each. Uh, 300 and 3,000 shields at only 118 long by like 40-something like wide. Very nice. And some kind of 
metrically insane thrust mass. So it's not the one at the bottom, it is this one. Above mm -hmm. your head. Oh, I forgot. Hold on. I can't use them anyway. No. There you go. Oh. Yes. Yes. And... Right, so the idea is you close the door behind you and you hit the gravity block. Nice. Very nice. So, turbo lift, epic bridge with joysticks, Riker mode engage. And they have. <laughs> uh, we have, uh, if you hit the gravity block by the door, you have the speedy exit. Hit the gravity block by the door. Alright. Yep. Whoa, no, that's the wrong one. Hang on. Uh, that's the one that goes down. Ah, nice. Speedy oh, exit. Wow, that really does work, doesn't it? I got quite far away from the ship then. I like that. Yep, it's, uh, I guess, emergency <laughs> escape hatch. Fleet approves. It'd be nice if the distance that you fall would be somehow related to the length of your ship or something like that. Yes, it would. So then you could like, design a bigger gravity window in. I don't know. So then, the name of this ship, please. SFW Crosswind. SFW really liking the uh, attention to detail in the hull shape with the wedging, choice of colour as always, you've got nice little details here and there, the turrets don't stick out, they actually add to the shape of the ship, I think it would look a bit different without those turrets on there. So it, you, Indeed, it looks uh, a lot faster. Yeah, it makes up, it makes it, it makes up the shape of the ship, which is nice, you know, they, they don't just sort of, they don't just stick out. <coughs> Um, and then obviously the engine design, you know, your trademark uh, wedging diagonals. And fins, fins are like winnie bit, winnie bits, but they're vertical winnie bits. I tried to do a little bit more on the uh, 45 degree angle with these as well. Hello, is there a stealth bomber in? Someone's photo bombing your review. Test, test. <laughs> So, That's yeah. actually a stealth bomber. It is actually a stealth bomber. It's gone now. It's gone. It's like it was never. It was it even here? So, <laughs> there we go. Very nice. Love the new. Sh love the ship, mate. Love the ship. And is this available for public release? Uh, no, but it will be very soon. Uh, oh, your so local community content forum. Yeah, so keep an eye on Delmont's uh, release list. So thanks for that. I'm going to move on to the next ship in the review. Uh, All right, sounds good. Super awesome. I will catch you later.